Hello and welcome. Still race here with Cyberpunk 2077. So I have been home for a good night's rest and a shower and I'm not here to meet Pan Am. I figure let's actually do something a little bit more meaningful than just shooting gangers in cyber cycles. I still plan to go out there and slaughter all the cyber cycles, but let's uh, get this thing well, at least started. Alright. So. Hey, what the? Well, I am definitely not parking my bike right here in the middle of, you know, road. Somebody's gonna crash into the damn thing. Okay. Fine. Here it is then. Now, if I. If I. Saw the map correctly. There is a. Because I was looking at this thing. There is one of those. Those, those. Um, oh no, it's here. Okay. Oh, it's a different part. I, I was just looking because I, I rode, rode the bike all the way here and I was like, hey, there is some tarot card nearby and whatnot. And I realized it's actually not here. Oh, there is a tarot card. All right, fine. Well, eventually go and get those two. Let's put the gun away and talk to the lady. Hey, Pan Am? So you're V. Where's my car? Why does it matter? What's wrong with this one? It's borrowed. It's not mine. I asked where my car is. <clears throat> Agree to help me, you'll find out. Oh, fuck no. You will not jerk me around. Tell me where my car is. Fuck me, you always on the warpath? Only when someone tries to jerk me around. Where the hell is my car? I tell you, and then what? Gonna storm off, handle it all by yourself? That is no concern of yours. None. Listen to me. Listen to me. You need my help. And you'll get it. I mean that. Right after we solved my problem. Fine. Say it. What do you want? Need to hit a Kangtao transport. Won't be easy. Wanna know I can count on you. Are you out of your goddamned mind? About you or the job. Kangtao's AV route will take it over Jackson Plains. Heard that should help us. Yeah, I doubt it. Gonna be a guy on board. Need to talk to him. Fuck. In return, info on your cargo, help in getting back what's yours. We got a deal. I don't know. I... Shit! All right, deal. But if you want your thing done, we'll need to get my Thornton back first. So where is it? Cars in Rocky Ridge. You're supposed to know where that is. Car's there. Goods are there. Nash, you dirty-eating bastard. I will strangle you. Nash a chum of yours? He hang you out to dry? Do not call him that. Fine. Partner. Former. If ever. The shift tricked me. He straight nipped my truck out of the merch. Probably now aims to sell it off in Rocky Ridge. Is he ever going to be fucking disappointed? Rocky Ridge. Let's go. Uh, hang on. I, I, I should think this through. Fuck. Yes. We'll need backup. We have one brief stop to make on the way. Wanna tell me where? Give me a sec. I should call the client. Convince them to leave the bastard hanging. Going ahead with the deal behind Rogue's back. Brave, I guess. Or fucking dumber than a drum. Buzz, hey. Nash is gonna pass you the merch in Rocky Ridge. The thing is, the motherfucker screwed me over. Buzz, I will take care of it. I just need you to give me a chance. Buzz, come on. How many times have I moved things for you? And how many times have I failed? You have my word. After dark? Okay. No, don't call off the meat. Just don't show up. I'll take care of everything. Do you even have to ask? Of course I will. 
Thanks, boss. You won't regret this. Okay. I have bought us some time. Gave that meathead your word and he took it? Is that surprising? It's called having a reputation. You should try getting one of your own. Oh, I like her. I like her, huh? Who the hell's Boz? Won't cause us any grief, I hope. Boz is a stand-up guy. Sixth Street. You drive for gang goons. Is that not allowed? Street punks need things moved. I need money like anyone else. So, where to now? The Aldecaldo camp. I need to see some of the old clan. Don't seem too excited. That's not your concern. I still have friends there. Good, let's roll. Get in. Okay, well, I guess you're driving. I guess you're driving. It's a Thornton too, you do you realize that, right? You're getting a different Thornton back? Where'd you get the ride? Straight out of some driveway in Rancho? Yes, exactly. Is that a problem? For me, no, not at all. I mean, there's no accounting for taste. Screw you. How the hell did you land in this mess? I liked the color. The air freshener and booster seat came extra. You know I don't mean the car. What am I supposed to tell you? That I'm not about to let my partner rob me and get away with it? That my fixer made me look like a goddamned fool? What about you? Why do you need that clown from the AV? This particular clown's got intel I need. And I'm running out of time to get it. So why didn't she tell me she knew about Nash? Rogue, do better not to worry what her agenda might be. God damn, I can't stand the bitch. Rogue's queen of the afterlife. Plays her pawns as she pleases. Did you just call me a pawn? I got a good look at her. She rose to the top because she reads people. So what if she keeps things to herself? It's a skill in her profession. Well, I think she's a lying, manipulative bitch. She put me together with that raffin. Did you know that? Wait, Nash is raffin? Yes. He runs with the Wraiths, the largest raffin group in the area. You know about them, right? Mm-hmm. Nomads tossed out of clans. Yes, mostly. Nomads don't banish their own without a reason. So think murderers, rapists, freaks. They gather in teams. Sometimes form actual gangs. Most of them are wanted and have warrants on their heads. Shit. And that bitch had me working with scum like that. Must have had her reasons. You don't say. Rogue won't open her mouth without weighing the for and against. What to spill and what to withhold. Well, yeah, she's, she has suddenly changed since the day she was, you know, running bodyguard business with Santiago back in 2020, or 2020s anyway. So, yeah, definitely, definitely a change of pace there at home. Actually, here is, what happened to Santiago? This is something I haven't actually found any info in the game, at least I don't remember finding any info in the game so far. But what happened to Santiago? Did he get slaughtered somewhere? Or did he just simply just stop hanging around with Rogue? That's a good question. Maybe we will find out. Or, or maybe I will go and dig up uh, once, uh, you know, if I don't find. Okay, we're almost there. We'll gather my guys, then ride to Rocky Ridge. Your guys? You the boss here? Awesome. Okay, yeah, these guys do have some proper off-road cars here. Yeah. Assault in Prague. Definitely not here, though. Well, would you look what the cat dragged in. Is that a ghost or is it just my hangover? Um, okay. Stop dragging me, you lady. Fuck you, too. Mm-hmm. And who's this? My babysitter. 
V, this is Scorpion. Mitch. Two old friends. Hey, guys. Hello? What brings you to these parts, city girl? The big city got too small for her. Do you have any idea how angry the old man's gonna be when he sees you here? I've just come by for a spell. Saul needn't know a thing. The Raffin screwed me over. I'll get them back, but I need your help. Come with me. We'll thrash them, the four of us. You know we would do anything for you, sister. But now? Now's hard. Seriously? You won't help? Uh, well, the old man told us to sit tight and get those generators back up after the batteries went kaput. Generators? You won't help because of some goddamn generators? Is this another joke? We'll manage without him. Shut it. Don't be a dick, Mitch. Help me. Not this time. We're needed here. Fuck. I don't believe this. So you'll stay put because Saul told you to. You couldn't care less about me. I am. This isn't about Saul. It's about the clan. You know that. Listen, we can't leave camp. No chance, but... But Saul never said a thing about gear. Okay. Well, I'll need that rifle of yours. And some of my own stuff. Take whatever you want. And take care of yourself out there. Yeah. Thanks, guys. I'll grab the gear, then be out of your hair. Yeah, uh, they they really didn't go for the guilt trip you tried to pull off about caring like for about you. Mm-hmm. You disappointed? I don't know. Maybe a little, yes. Wait, so there's a there there there's a reaper hey, here. Are you staying a while? No, I'll be going again soon. We'll talk next time. Hey, Pan Am. So I'm gonna stop by the reaper while you find your gear. See what this guy has for sale. Ten reflexes. Ten percent health after defeating an enemy. Okay, that that's actually cheap enough that I could buy that right now. But I don't have the reflexes for a. I mean, the drones max and robots by twenty percent. Ten technical. That is not horrible either. Oh, this reminds me. Didn't I have? Um... Didn't I have? Well, do you have, uh, don't have anything to replace that with, and you, 12 body, no, not happening anytime soon here. 8 body, oh right, yeah, I could, I could sl sl slot this in by increasing my body by 1. Actually, that might be something worth doing right now, what do you have for operating systems? Quick habits on targets and devices while scanning. Mm-hmm. So RAM recovery rate by three per 60 seconds. Okay, that is actually not horrible. Nine base RAM as well. Because I don't I don't care about quick hack damage, which makes this this uh, biotech here a lot worse. I need money. Damn, I need money. I can hopefully get some some cash out of this thing because this this looks like it could be worthwhile. Maybe maybe I go uh go check out some other stuff first. Um, I do want the double jump fi finally at some point. Do you have anything? Oh, ew! Another thing for eight body, which. I would have the eight body, huh? Forty-three is three grad. All cyberware cooldowns by other Okay, eighteen body though. Ten body now. Wait, what? No, 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 no. Don't, don't. Not happening. But that eight body might actually happen because I do believe. Yeah, I do have a black point, and we could actually use that here. 
to get some some value out of things, huh? So I could switch this in for a little bit more health, and uh, I can I can sell that. I can sell that for a little bit of money. That actually gives me the cash for this. I think I might wait though. I might see if I can find a better version. And this this is actually well. Uh, Three recovery rate uh, of three by for sixty seconds, which is, I mean, this is nine per sixty seconds. But the base RAM size is a lot bigger, a lot bigger. And this thing has the extra quick hack damage, which does nothing for me. Which I, I say, I only use essentially only use the quick hack stuff for for. Okay. Oh, uh, I meant to actually check. Yes. Didn't I have? Yeah, I had. Um. I don't really need th a threat detector, do I? Precise explosion radius of grenade of your grenade. Not really useful. I do want an upgraded Kiroshi. Twenty-five percent headshot bonus damage seems pretty damn good, though. This is this is kind of this is kind of nice, however, to be able to um see everybody through walls. But give me that, give me that, like two percent crit and twenty five percent headshot damage, and I can sell one more one of these threat detectors. I think make a little cash out of that. Let's make a little cash out of that, right? Um, cyberware mods, and I have two threat detectors, you can have one. Okay, um, give me a sec, I'm gonna check the... You brought someone... They were about to talk about me, huh? Alright, 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 alright. Do you sell anything of interest? Penetrator spec. Don't think so. That worth it? I don't. I'm not sure. Saratoga. Oh, that could be interesting. Tactician. If you had Blue Crusher, I would be real tempted. Then again, I wouldn't have the cash for it anyway. Um. Tactician could also be kind of nice, but Saratoga, I don't think so. Considering I have this thing, which is kind of awesome. Have you brought someone new? Does Saul know? Not your concern, friend. That was a sarcastic friend, wasn't it? Okay. Don't point it at me. Will you help me with this? What's inside? A few odds and ends that should be useful. Take it. All right, that's everything. Let's go. So, you bring a big gun and I bring a box. You figure out your differences with Sol? Will you come back? Wait, you are not even responding to that? Okay, fine, never mind. I mean, not my business. I am not. I don't really need to butt in on 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 hey, your. You'll stop by later, right, honey? Next time, Ellie. I promise. Okay. Well, I got I got a little bit of cyberware stuff done, so that that's decent. But one extra body point. Eh, that's fine. So, I'm off. Yeah, yeah. Go on, go already. Call us sometime. Keep an eye on her, V. Okay. Put it in the trunk. Actually, uh, out of... Fine, I guess I'm keeping an eye on her. That, that sounds kind of bothered then, though. We can go. Hop in. I am in. You're the one who was being lazy. Okay, um... Now, where the blazes are we off to? Were those two in the army? Scorp and Mitch? Yeah. Panzer boys. They were on contract during the last war. Panzer boys? Flew those huge transporters? Scorpion piloted. Mitch ran security. They both got some kick-ass combat implants and a stack of really fucked up nightmares. Yeah, that will happen. Mitch and Scorpion seem good souls. The best friends a girl could ask for. I'd stay in the camp too if I were in their shoes. Fuck Saul and his generators, of course. Yet the clan comes first. 
but I'm not part of it anymore. Still treated you like you're one of them. They care about you. Mm-hmm. Do you have anyone you would call close? Haven't been so lucky. I see. Do I, do I go, you know, I mean, fine. Seems you got a real problem with authority. What? Rogue, Saul, your leader? Their leader. Seemed in a hurry to delta the hell out of there. Let's just say Saul wouldn't have been happy to see me. What happened? The reason we came to California was because he promised change for the Alda Caldos. He claimed we would turn over a new leaf. But you saw it. We got a handful of tents on a heap of sand. A hell of a promised land. I wanted something different. Better. Saul's a damned coward. He'll be the end of the clan, I'm certain. So, Rocky Ridge. Empty, dusty hole in the middle of bumfuck nowhere, I heard. Natives either moved to Night City or just got the hell out. Then you know almost all there is to know. The whole area was waiting on a new interstate extension. It was supposed to breathe new life into the town. It didn't happen, of course. How many ghost towns do you think are there? Hundreds? Countrywide? Thousands. I drove down I-80 the other day. All you have to do is pull over after sundown. It's quiet then. And you hear it. What's that? The wind whistling through boarded up windows. Tumbleweeds scratching across dry, sandy tracks. That's how towns die. Not with a bang, but with whispers and whimpers. I need you doing poetry now. I'm not complaining. That was awesome. That was awesome. Yeah, destroyed cars everywhere. And so on. Oh man. Yeah, welcome to the ghost towns. Okay. We have arrived. What do we do? We get ready to greet the Raffins. And we've little time for that. We'll need to improvise. We should scout first, to look for anything that might be useful. Well, it says broken. Is that useful? <laughs> okay, I, I I guess we run around a little then. See what I can steal. Um, You know, for usefulness sake. Um... Right. So let's check the... Can you even get in there? Yeah, kind of. I mean, it does have... How come nobody has come and taken the goddamn solar panels out? Those could, those could definitely be useful for, let's say, nomads. Right? Would be very useful. I'm guessing there is like nothing actually useful in these buildings out here. In the middle of nowhere. And they won't probably let us in because that would be like. Okay. Locked. But they. Did they model the interior? They modeled the interior at least a little bit. Is that a sign that this. this we can get inside this building? Probably not. Probably not. No, they didn't model the interior. It's just underneath the building. Okay, so probably not. And I might I might have taken this scouting a little too seriously, huh? Uh, honestly, I am just out here uh, satisfying my kleptomania. Take everything that's not nailed down. Is this a point where we get royally drunk and then, then wait for the nightfall to land and, and then ambush people? Uh, is that how we're gonna do this? Because I, I am guessing that's how we're gonna do this. And I'm not finding anything useful. Bloody hell. Give me, give me so, at least something. Like seriously. I mean obviously this place would have been cleared out ages ago, but then again nobody has come and Taking those damn solar panels either. Oh, there we go. See? The kleptomania is paying off. What? 
We are here, our first home. Life in the big city has its terms, but there's no place like home, right? Why do we ever leave? I don't even remember myself. I suppose wanted a little adventure. Give the kids the opportunity to never had. If in city I did what I could, I did everything I could, I miss you. Somehow it's easier when I write to you. I'm sorry for everything. Ooh. Ooh. Ouch. Yeah. I'm just going a little loony and coming out here and... Well, if he was dead, hopefully his kids didn't die. If he even had kids and they weren't, like, imaginary and he thought that he brought them with him. Uh, you know. Yeah. I am... Hey. I am... I am out here scouting. Don't fault me for scouting. I did find find some crap, but not a lot of it. Not a lot of it. Apparently I'm getting athletic spawns. I'm doing something. I have to say though, uh, I really dislike how they uh, dislike this athletics thing of how they were they decided to build it. It could have made it a lot more interesting in a variety of ways. Like instead of going. Um, I, I, might, I might just talk about this idea while I'm while I'm you know running around here and and seeing if I can find loot. Um, having it randomly essentially go up while you just sprint around is kind of stupid. That that is an old mechanic used by various old games where it was basically just grind. It was used as a sort of a, like a grinding thing. And honestly, it is really, really dumb system. Make it uh, go up a lot faster, but make it require you to actually do things in combat. For example, sliding around in combat. Like, that sort of, that sort of stuff. So that it essentially... Essentially make it uh, so that the, it's part of the combat system of how it goes up. When you're running around, reloading, in combat, and so on, it goes up. Not not, not just, you know, just randomly sprinting around. Okay, so there is a there is a place to sell crap here. So I'm guessing we're about to have a... Oh, hello. Great damage increase by 10%. Okay. Rate of fire by 5%. What does rate of fire increase do to recoil? Is it just purely rate of fire increase but doesn't uh, change recoil at all? Okay. Let's go up. Right. So, my kleptomancy thing really just paid off in, in near, the, near the main thing, which is, I guess, kind of understandable. Armor increase. Another fa another scourge. Okay. Interesting. What? Shouldn't damage my legs. Not high enough. Oh. Okay. I have the body for this. Interesting. Yeah. See, st th this is this is the kind of stuff the um you know getting athletic points up and so on actually makes sense, but. More phantoms? Okay, they really want me to fire quickly. Um, waste bullet. As you know, rats are the prime carriers of dangerous diseases. The eradicator lets you. Ah, okay. Why? It's a marketing pamphlet. Another scourge. Is that useful? Use box. It's the only open fuse box I have seen so far, I think. I'm guessing that's it. Um, let me check this thing and then I will check the main building. Okay. I'm opening that then. Another phantom. Okay. Ooh, ooh grenades. Alright, those are useful. I found some grenades. Do you want any or can I keep them all? 
Well done. Alright. Alright. Oh, come on. There we go. Nothing useful here. From Maisie. What? Maisie knows it's going to be fine. I'm done talking anyway. Nothing more to say. I'm just done. It's over. Blah, blah, blah. Stay in this ghost town. I'd rather you didn't see... Come see the kid. Oh. Oh, is this... Is this... Who the other dude was writing letters to? Is that... Is that Maisie? Okay, come on. Let me out. Thank you. Okay, sorry about the random shotgun noises. I needed to get in there and there was only a window in the way, so... Is that... Okay, I didn't need to shoot my way into this one. Really? Okay then. Okay then. Fine. Recon grenade. The heck is a recon grenade? One pan and a headband and neurotoxin knife. Be careful not to cut yourself. Okay. All right. Well, that's money. I am ha happy to take some money. And also happy to take more loot. That's a lot of phantoms and stuff in here. Uh, speaking of which, do I have... Yeah, I have frag grenades and max dogs equipped. Very good. Um, okay. Go upstairs as well. Anything here? Except a hole in the, in the floor. I'm not seeing anything. God dang it. Yeah, I would follow room through the hall. I think they are just booths for drinking in, right? Pathology of the Badlands. Is this like. I told you the dream of becoming a nomad adventurer. Mistake! Oh, jeez, it's one of these things. Do you have romantic dreams of the Badlands? I didn't think so. Uh, yeah, I don't think this is... Oh, jeez. It's one of those. Okay, what was that? More, more things to read. Have you wondered how this book ended up in your hands? Where it came from? Who did it? No, I haven't. I just picked it up. Most shipments were made via sea and freighters, cheap, quick, and relatively safe. Fourth core, yeah. Single object, destroy enemy vessels. Yep. Yep. Fourth corporate war was uh, was insane. Okay, we all, we all all know that. Fine, let's talk to Pan Am. Or am I supposed to open this thing? Probably not. Um, I think I have, like, looked everywhere. Did you? Scan the device. Oh. Oh, I'm supposed to scan stuff. I did. We should have said that we are... We should have been, you know, scouting stuff with... Uh... That's your Thornton. Okay, how do I get top? From here, right? I didn't realize I had more stuff up here. Defender! Ooh, ouch. That looks like it could have hurt. Cookie and Morate. What? Hell. You and Nina take the station roof. Okay. Ammo. Fine. The heck is that? Surveillance camera. It's off. It could be any debtor. Everything's down. Nothing works here. 
Okay, guessing we need to turn stuff on then. Well, have you found anything? No dice. Nothing's up. I'll cut off. Oh, we'll make it work. The Raffins will roll in after dusk. We will have a surprise ready for them. We just need to get some power flowing. Let's check the substation. Okay. Let's go over. Okay, so it really is about scanning shit instead of just, you know, actually scouting stuff. Let the damn. Found the breakers, but there's no juice on them. Not to worry. Come down. I know how to surprise the bastards. I think I found what they're connected to as well, though. This thing. I think. Right. So, the intersection is powered from that transformer substation, right? The switch gear on the roof. We'll flip the switch there and everything will light up like Christmas. Understood? Hmm. Hmm. Do I? V? Yeah, give me a sec. I'm, I'm thinking here because... You know what? I think flipping on the lights at the intersection will give us the upper hand. Really? First, we don't know how many are coming. My thinking is it'll be a sizable crew. Second, we have to create an opening to get to my car. If they're bunched together, we won't stand a chance. So we give them a little light show at the intersection? Yes. We'll breathe some life into this dusty old town. Soon as they see the lights, they'll have to check who, why, and how. Nova. Yep. First, we start up the control terminal below. The gear on the roof is a hunk of junk without it. Come on, we'll give it a boost from the car battery. That should do the trick. Wait for me by the substation. I'll bring the car around. Oh jeez. This is gonna fry our fry the car, right? And then we don't have then we have no other option than to kill everybody and take their cars. Oh bloody well. Yeah, okay then. Just as though, you know, I don't, I don't know how. The panel looks to be in good shape. I'll make a bypass circuit to the power supply. That should do it. We'll just have to get it up and running. Grab the jumper cables from the trunk. We'll boost it from the car battery. Oh, geez, this is a bad idea. This is a really bad idea. Lady, did you know that already in like 2023, uh, at this point in time, you take a modern car and you try to jumper cable it and you're gonna fry the electronics in your car in most cases? You're not supposed to jumper cable, um, you know, modern cars. And this is fluffing 2070. Okay, never mind. Let's not argue logistics with. Oh, you have ammo for me. And bounce backs. Okay, fine. I will take your ammo and bounce backs. Let's 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 not uh, argue lo logics with her. Red cable connected. Give me a moment. I need to hook everything up here. Ooh. Yeah. Um. And done. Now the black rattler. This goes into the into the body of the car. You know, right? That right. No. Oh, Jesus. There yeah. she goes. Thought the old jalopy served us well. Yeah. Like I said. Okay, I've got voltage. Start the terminal inside. And once the power is on in the building, get on that roof. You got it. I'll set up on the tower. We'll have the whole intersection on a platter. You flip the breakers when I give you the signal to do so, understood? Yes, ma'am. Like, yeah, I, I knew it would fry our car. Now, the only option is to actually slaughter everybody so we can take their cars. I mean, I'm guessing you are entirely up for that, but... Generally, you kind of want to put the black... Put the black as in the zero cable into the body of the car instead of the battery. Just a, you know, just a reference. Uh, now obviously it depends. Okay, let, let's not talk real, real world, um, real world how this is done in actual real world. Yes. Substation. Yes, it has nothing to do with, you know, video game gameplay. Oh. Switch gear's got power. Prime. We'll have some fun at the intersection. Let's get into position. But, uh, yeah, let, so... 
Yeah, as said, let's not talk about real world and, and how you jumper cable actual cars in the real world, because one would wish that the, uh, you know, game developers would, would take some, some cues from real world, and this seemed... It seemed realistic in the, in the sense that it actually fried the car battery to do this, so from that point of view, even though it's probably a storytelling thing, it, it also makes actual sense. And also, can I go somewhere else than sit around in this goddamn roof? Now we wait. Uh, seriously, I'm gonna go inside to wait in this, this dust storm. As soon as we see them, you give us power. Raffins will come from where? Any idea? The northeast, I wager. From the freeway that was never finished. Okay. Fine. Got it. Cover me, just in case. Of course. Guessing we are doing this in the damn sandstorm, then. They're rolling in. In my thorn. You see her? Really, really hard to miss. Let's take them by surprise. Let's try to do this quietly. If anything happens, I'll start picking them up. Sound good? Sounds great. Seriously? You want me to do things quietly? I guess we can try. Bless the son of a bitch, Buzz. You, wait for him here. Get good and ready. The show starts... now! Let there be light. Let's go down and have a look see around. Okay. So do this quietly, you said. I am not very good at this doing things quietly bit. I'm just letting you know right now, this is going to turn loud and violent here. Very, very, very soon. I don't think I'm gonna breach just yet. Okay, let's... Let's have a little bit of a luck. I think she went up. All, yeah, I think she went all the way up. I'm just gonna hang around a sec. And have a look. Where are these folks? Okay, so one is up there. We can definitely get that guy. Um, and you are wandering around here. I should probably go and get the Overwatch before I uh, before I touch anybody else. Unless that one wanders inside, which. Probably does not. Wait, where did they go? Okay, right there. Okay. She had hair dye. <laughs> okay, that is amazing. Alright. Now we do a little bit of sprinting around. I should I should be running a silencer on a on a on a high power handgun and use that for 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 this stuff, but honestly, I am not here to try and be a ninja. I am here. To try and get things done, and that usually involves loud and violent big firefight. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go and take care of the Overwatch first, and then we will worry about the rest. If I can take everybody outside uh, in 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 a quiet fashion, that is, that is already good enough. So then all I have to do is deal with everybody who's inside the building.
Let me get to the top from here. What was it that saw me? Is that a person? I think it was a person staring out of the out of the window on the top floor. Okay, these two are just hanging around here. That's fine. There was at least one more person outside. Man, did they turn out uh, to be loud, folks. That one is looking right at here. Let's, uh, I'm kind of glad that I actually did a whole proper run around because I have sort of an idea of where, where folks are or what the area is like. Can I get this guy? I bet you if I crap go for this guy, somebody from the inside is gonna, gonna know this. Oh, jeez. We're gonna turn around right about now, right? Yep. Not good. Not good. I just like this lean mechanic. And gun sideways is a bad idea. Do we just... Do we just skip this whole stinking around thing? And start taking people out? You know... Be nice and fast about it? Fast and loud and all of that good stuff. Alright, so that guy is wandering in that direction. This dude... Right here. He's gonna turn around real soon. There we go. Here's hoping nobody sees me. Holy moly. Okay, there is too many people in very close proximity to each other. So, yeah, screw that. I think it is time to be loud and violent. Hmm? It is time to be loud and violent. Yep, yeah, that was the idea. I'm hoping that I can see somebody through this window. I do love this thing. still people alive. You know that, right? Wait. Did you? Oh, yeah. I think she killed everybody. Well, then. She sniped, sniped the folks outside, which is fine. Entirely fine by me. Entirely fine by me. Well, honestly, thought I there was somebody up here. 
looking out from this window uh, because somebody saw me to take out the uh, take out their Overwatch. Yeah, I think I think she took out. Yeah. Oh, good job here. Good job here. Up with jiggling. Uh, I'm gonna go loot the Overwatch. So give me just a sec. There was nothing but a goddamn bag, body bag left of the of the. You wanna drive? You know what? Before we go get anywhere further with this, I'm gonna call it an episode right here. Thank you very much for watching, and I will see you folks next time with more Cyberpunk 2077.